Hello everyone. You know, I was thinking about you and I thought it's time for us to have another cup of coffee together. And kind of in person this time, instead of me just writing everything out and posting it on Facebook. So I decided, let's do it. Let's do a video. I've never done this before, but I'm game. Let's do it. I don't know about you, but I love coffee cups. I have them with all different kinds of sayings on them. And the one that I happened to pull out this morning has Winnie the Pooh on it. I'm a big fan of Winnie the Pooh also. When my son was little, he loved Winnie the Pooh. We used to watch Winnie the Pooh together every Saturday morning. And so my coffee cup this morning has Winnie the Pooh on it. And it says, after God made me, he said, ta-da! And you know what? After God made me, he did say, ta-da. After he made you, God said, ta-da. And you know how I know this? Because in Ephesians chapter 2, verse 10, it says, For we are God's masterpiece. He has created us anew in Christ Jesus, so we can do the good things he planned for us long ago. We are God's masterpiece. You know, many years ago, there was a vacation Bible school that the theme was, I am God's masterpiece. And it used this scripture as the main verse for the whole week. And we talked to the kids how, about how God had created them just as they were. Had created them, each one different, but nobody was a mistake. That God created every one of them and every one of them had a purpose. And you know... That's the same for all of us. We are all God's masterpiece. He creates every human being to be his masterpiece. Now, think about that. What is a masterpiece? You know, it's a, a gem. It's a jewel. It's a prize. It's a treasure. And we are God's treasures. You know, that word that we translate there as masterpiece, it's not used for anything else in God's creation. All of the beautiful stuff that God created, the whole beautiful world, it's only human beings that the word masterpiece is used to describe. Wow. Think about that. Think about it. How much God loves us to call us his masterpiece. You know, despite our failures, despite all of our junk, we are his masterpiece. It's not because of any great thing we do. It's not because we're so good and, and amazing we didn't earn that status. It's simply because he loves us. He created us. And then he sent Jesus Christ to reconcile us to him so that we can live with him eternally. So that we, while here on this earth, can enjoy a full, abundant life. Wow. We are his masterpiece. So when God made us, he really did say, ta-da! Think about that today. And remember... We have worship Sunday morning, 9 o'clock, at the Family Life Center outside. 
We're going to go a little early, hopefully beat the heat of the day. And I know it's still going to be hot, but, you know, all things are relevant. So it's going to be cool when you consider the rest of the day. Think about it like that. It's going to be the coolest part of the day. And hope to see you there. It'll be my first Sunday with you. And I am so excited and looking forward to it. Have a great weekend.